Some Taos teachers say their profession is being stomped on, citing a laundry list of issues surrounding teacher evaluations. Now they're taking a stand. We need to teach our kids, not test them. After sending students off for summer break, a group of elementary school teachers in Taos received their evaluations. It's not difficult to tell from this video what happened next. It was very freeing. It was a way for, for us to show that we're not going to stand for this anymore. One Taos teacher who spoke with us over the phone asked to remain anonymous, but says she was there for the burning. She says this was about sending a message to the state. The new teacher evaluations have been the center of controversy since they were put into place by the state's public education department. The evaluations are based on standardized testing, classroom observations, and other factors like student surveys. The Taos teacher says she was graded effective, but when you add up her scores, this is her grade. That's a D plus. That's not okay. It's on par with most New Mexico teachers. 76% received a rating of effective or better. The Taos teacher says a D is not good enough. And she blames the fact that students' standardized test scores make up a good portion of teachers' grades. Our students are more, much more than a once-a-year pencil and bubble sheet. She's not the only one. Other Taos teachers plan to burn their scorecards, too. We try to to then take what should be in our field, a diagnostic tool, and turn it into an evaluative tool is patently wrong. The state's public, the state public education secretary, Hannah Skandera, says the state has taken a broken evaluation system and improved it. The old evaluations relied on a pass-fail system. She argues the new system gives educators a better picture of teachers and students. Crystal, back to you. All right, thanks, Catherine. Taos teachers aren't alone when it comes to sending the state a message. A group of Albuquerque teachers burned their evaluations at a sit-in on Wednesday.